Mr. Carnegie, you have named the budgeting of time as one of the essentials for individual achievement. Will you indicate what methods one should adopt to make the best use of his time? Every successful person plans his life as carefully as a successful businessman plans his business. He begins by adopting a definite major purpose, and he follows through by devoting a definite proportion of his time to attaining the object of that purpose. What proportion of one's time should be devoted to the attainment of his major purpose? To begin with, let us recognize that the average person comes into the world with nothing but time as an asset. Every person has 24 hours of time each day, no more, no less. When a person reaches the age of personal responsibility, he should divide his time into three periods. One, one for sleep, two, one for work, and three, one for recreation. The usual distribution of this 24 hours per day period is one, eight hours for sleep, two, eight hours for work, and three, eight hours for recreation. Some people, perhaps the majority of them, find it necessary to work 10 hours per day in order to maintain the present standard of living, while they devote but six hours per day to recreation. The average person cannot get along on less than eight hours of sleep.